but I'm recording. The Chicago Bears traded Justin Fields uh, to the Pittsburgh Steelers for a fourth round pick for this year's draft. Depends how good he does. It'll be a fourth round, but it's a sixth round pick. Excuse me about that. I'm kind of still shell shocked, to be honest with you. I really thought there was a chance, a slim chance they're going to keep him. But Fields was 0 and 6 to the Packers. And also, Minnesota has perhaps got worse, but the Lions have gotten a lot better. And his track record overall is not so good. So, I think they're going to draft uh, Caleb Williams from USC. Caleb Williams is like 235, 61. And I think why they're going to draft him, to be honest with you, I kept on thinking about it. Yeah, he was on a bad team. But he was the main person that did pretty good on a bad team. Although he lost to Notre Dame and he cried with his mom. And uh, he also uh, lost to Utah when he wrote F Utah on his fingernails. But you want that, I think you want that attitude of him to have that hatred against the Packers and whoever else is a rivalry. And if Trubisky and Cutler wasn't doing it, and uh, Fields is now an ex bear. The way I look at it, I understand the pick. Would I have done that personally if I was the general manager? I don't know. I think I would have traded that pick and uh, get Marvin Harrison Jr. kept Fields. But knowing the money, they could build a team a lot faster. Um, so Fields never did broke the season record for 30 touchdowns and 4,000 yards. Will Williams do it? I think so. Uh, maybe not as a rookie. But uh, you too. So you have to look at next year, 2025, 2026. And uh, I don't know. I mean, what do you think? Would you have done the move? I don't know. I'm torn. Look, they got, they got rid of Mooney, Fields, uh, St. Brown's not there. They got Pettis back. They traded for Allen. Uh, they traded uh, for DJ Moore last year. Now you put Williams as your rookie quarterback, and you bring in Baggett as a second your quarterback is a backup, and Ripken is a third backup. Um, in case you need a third quarterback, he's your second backup, third quarterback. What do I see the Bears' record to be? I mean, if they can repeat what they did last year, being 7-10, and 10, that's pretty good for a rookie. And I could see Williams throwing for, let's see, 22 touchdowns, maybe? 20, 3,500 yards, give or take. Um, we'll see how he does. That's my hot take. And uh, I was going to do this earlier, but I couldn't. So, bear down.